Let me get some Ponsuda playing while we wait. Oh, I see it. Now I just gotta get everything set up while we let people filter in. I'll send you a link to the stream if you want to get have chat pulled up on it somewhere on your screen. Or the, I only have one screen, unfortunately. Oh yeah, dude. I for a long time I was a holdout. I I stayed with one screen for a minute, and then I got a second screen, and it changed my life. I know, but I'm ready for it. Honestly, I need to go ahead and get it. I actually have another screen, but I need a cord that will connect to my GPU. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's... I had to get a really long HDMI cable. Because my desk setup is a little wonky. Yeah. Yo, what's good? Cookmaster Jeff, Hayden, and DXVL Player. We already got a few people coming into stream. Already. Everybody show some love to my boy Pon Suda. What it do? In the cut. Much love to everybody. Shit right here is a Texas anthem. Oh, yeah. Let's do a bat emoji. Do you want a bat emoji or a uh, like a lipstick kissing? No, but we're gonna do the bat, bro. The bat. Let's get it. I'm about to put a bat on a polo shirt. Oh shit! You gotta hit me up when that <laughs> drops. <laughs> yeah. Post a link to the stream in the Discord. This shit is smooth as hell. This song has probably like 3,000 plays. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Let me get it pulled up, actually. I got to refresh the page. You're thinking 3,000? I'll lock in Jeez. for you. You were right. 3,233. This guy knows his stats. <laughs> Welcome, everybody, to stream. Skinny when he says, my Russian friend thought you were Freddy Dread, no joke. You know, I get that a lot. <laughs> but uh, Freddy Dread could two, never. Two very different people. I know both of them. you clo close friends with Fredward? I mean, we're not super close, but I've definitely hung out with them and talked to them. Hey, that's more than I can say. We homies, you know? Like, we fuck that's with tight. each other. We got 13 people in chat already. Damn. I ain't even yeah. post about it on Instagram yet. Let me get that going. I'll tag you. Shit. All right. Let's see. I wonder if... Oh, no. I wonder if I click out a Discord on my phone if it will take away the camera. Um, it might, I'm not sure. But if it does, it'll start showing my video on here and then it'll look like I'm talking to myself on the stream, which is pretty funny, so. <laughs> the sound is kind of messed up. It's kind of like fuzzy, you know? Oh, for real? Yeah. I'm listening to it from your stream, I think. Mm. Oh, there it goes. It's much better now. There it is. We back. Hey, bro, I haven't listened to lo-fi in a minute. 
Yeah, I think this is the first related track on your uh, on, oh, wow. on your track hating. <laughs> okay. All right, one moment, folks. Just gonna post an Instagram story, let everybody know what's up, and then we'll get started. Once again, very thrilled to have special guest Ponsuda on this yo, yo, yo. week's stream. Much love to everybody. Thank you, y'all, for pulling up. Did, I did this like four times during the Lil Rocket Man stream. I accidentally posted it to my close friend's story instead of my actual story. God damn it. <laughs> so goddamn annoying. But All right, don't let me do it again. I, just, I literally spent like 10 minutes trying to figure out how to fucking <laughs> post it correctly I last time. Name. You got some cloud bug in your related tracks. Hell yeah. Only because this is some an cloud action. bug action. This is a dream. And you're part of that dream. He, uh, he's like one of my faves uh, at the moment. That's revolting. No more maniacs loose than one thing. That's just tripping me out because it's not showing the place. Yeah. I posted it to the correct story on my second attempt, chat. Let's get it. That is a lot to ask for me. Yes, sir. All right. I think we're about ready to get started here. How many we got? We got 17 in chat. Hell yeah. Jeez. Pretty decent turnout. We have not streamed the SoundCloud Game Show live in two, three weeks, actually. Not since the little Rocket Man stream. So this is a big one. Perfect timing. Hell yeah. All right, I'm gonna pause this here so I can explain the rules for anybody who's not acquainted. Uh, and once again, welcome everybody to chat. We got special guest Pon Suda here today on the SoundCloud Game Show, not officially associated with nor endorsed by SoundCloud yet. Haven't said that in a while, it's quite the <laughs> mouthful. Um, as, as, as many of you know, the way this game works is we'll pull up a random SoundCloud track that was submitted on the Discord. Link is in the description if you have not had a chance to submit a track yet. Um, we'll pull up a random track, and I have a Chrome extension that hides almost all of the identifiable information about the song, including the stats. So we're going to listen through it, kind of give our input on it, and try and guess how many streams it has on SoundCloud. Chat, you guys are going to participate as well. Chat versus me versus special guest Ponsuda of Holy Mob, which, if you ask me, best funk collective in the game. Gotta say. Gotta say. Right up. All right, Ponsuda, nope. what have you been up to? What have you been listening to lately? Listening to? Man, I've just really just been listening to a lot of soul music because I've been DJing in my city recently, so I've been trying to come up with playlists of soul music. But other than that, like, I just create a lot of music. So I just really listen to my own stuff or, you know, the mob stuff, of course. Like, any of my close friends need music, I always tune in to that. But for the most part, just be listening to my own music and a lot of soul stuff right now. Good shit. You said you play a lot of shows in your city. What is your city? Where can people see you live? Man, I'm in the DFW. You know what I'm saying? Born and raised. Um, right now, I got a residence or my team. Infinite Wave has a residency in Plano, so we play every week on Saturday, and we just play, like, dope music, you know, like soul, funk, R&B, etc., jazz. Like, we'll have a live sax player this coming Saturday. That's and lit. Then we just throw underground shows with, like, the homies, you know what I'm saying? Like, we try to book Vaughn or try to book Backwind coming soon, May. You know, we Hell just yeah. try to make, make moves in the city and, and try to create a culture of underground because there's a lot of stuff that people don't know about this man's out here doing the ground game doing the lord's work down in yeah. uh down in texas so if you're in texas if you're in the south go check him out infinite wave go see a show yes, here very soon all right yes, without sir, further ado community yes without further ado let's get the first track pulled up here let me make sure i'm in full screen actually so i can't see anything 
and we'll switch over to the actual gameplay screen. All right, first track, let's do this. Right off the bat, you can see this track comes to us from 21 days ago. So not super okay, okay. old, fairly recent. It's had some good time though. Some cool perks. Get it kind of nice. So this one could have as few as 600 streams or as many as 4,300. Interesting. And they have 62 tracks, you say? Yes, they got 62 tracks on SoundCloud. So they've been in the game for a minute. Shoot. Yeah, I'm a fan of the hi-hats on this one for sure. Yeah, they, real, they are clean. They definitely got a good mix going. A hard choice though, low key. Yeah, it is. I will say, I feel like these particular Project Pad vocals are a little overused at this point. I've heard them on like That's 300 funk tracks at this point. The sample itself too, but other than that, the mix is pretty good. They definitely know how to mix music. For sure. Yeah, the mix is clean. Some cool effects too. You can tell this person's been, you know, kind of honing their style. They've got a good, a good grasp on, you know, groove, rhythm. I like the drum work. I got my answer. You got your shit locked in. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, I'm gonna lock in a guess as well. All right, chat, it's that time. Let me get the poll open for you guys. If it wants to work. One moment. Refresh. All right, I think the poll is open now. Yes. You guys can vote in chat now. Exclamation point, vote, space. And then whatever letter option you want to vote for. If you're thinking this one's a little more on the underrated side, you could go with A, 678 streams. Or um, they got a they got a lot of tracks though. You know what I'm saying? So that's they true. Probably got, they probably got a little fan base. If I had to they guess, they do have a lot of tracks. Get your votes in, folks. Days. Or if you're thinking that you know it's not necessarily underrated, but it's not exactly going to be pulling 4,000 streams, you could go with B or C. They're pretty close. 2100 or 2400 it doesn't look like uh any of the votes were registered so i'm going to try opening the poll again that's weird what the fuck the poll is not working it is not working i see a couple votes coming in but it's not registering them for some reason all right Try to try to submit your votes now, guys. I think that it has officially restarted the poll. The problem is I don't see I don't see Cloudbot interacting in chat. Cloudbot's normally uh This is weird. Let me make sure. Sound got messed up. If you wanna, there it goes. Good now. I need to make sure. Uh, I need to make sure that Streamlabs is on here as a moderator, because for some reason it's not working. Yeah, they should. They should be able to do it. What the fuck? Hmm. Well, that's frustrating. Is there any way to troubleshoot it? Well, yeah, I'm not seeing um, the bot in chat. Normally, the bot is in chat saying when the when the poll is open and everything. Let me see. Oh, word. 
Sorry, y'all. I was not expecting it to just stop working randomly for no reason. What the fuck? I'm going to take a quick restroom break, but continue I... on as you fix the Absolutely. technical difficulties. I will be back in time for the second track. Hell yeah. Well, I guess this is what happens when you uh, don't stream for don't stream the, the game show for a couple weeks. It just stops working at some point. I don't know why. Let me get the poll options pulled up here. Poll. Hmm. 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 <laughs> I'm I'm losing my mind internally right now. This is extremely frustrating. I still have no idea why it would not be working. I... Streamlabs is added as a moderator, so we back chat. We back. So what's the word on the cloud bot? Um, well, it's still not working, unfortunately, but we're trying to get it fixed up. Yeah, so Streamlabs we have to figure like out not in the chat. Streamlabs needs to be in the chat to actually like make it work. But I have not seen any Streamlab messages pop up still for some reason. So let's see. Close poll. Yeah, because like when I open the poll and close the poll, it doesn't work. Yeah, I guess I'll just do a YouTube poll, but uh, let's see. We can make, try to make sure that Streamlabs account is connected to your Twitch account. Or uh, it says you can try restarting the software. We're Maybe. just going to do a YouTube poll. I wonder if, uh, wonder if that'll work. Worry. Is it like super easy? It is easy. It's just not automated. That's the only thing. All right. This, the poll, the YouTube poll is now live. It's not going to show up on stream, which is <laughs> shitty, but whatever. Man, what the fuck? All right. So far, we got 11 votes in here, and uh, chat is kind of torn between A and B. A and B. Yeah. They're thinking it's a little more on the underrated side. That's good. That's valid. It's, I think that's valid. Yeah, that's super weird. I don't know why it wasn't working. All right. The poll has officially been up for one minute. We got 17 votes in here. Hey. Oh my God. I end the poll. Okay, it shows me the shows the, result, the results here. Okay, good. All right. Chat, you guys are saying A. You guys think this one's a little more on the underrated side, which I think is fair. I think it's fair. Uh, it's only been out for 21 days, but may I remind you, I got 62 tracks on SoundCloud. So plenty of time to build up an audience, all of that. You know what I'm saying? Well, that said, I do agree with you, chat. I, I, I was thinking that this, pro this is probably on the more underrated side of things just because it's not really reinventing the wheel. Like I said, that, that particular project, Pat Acapella, has been used many, many times before. So that's the only reason I was a little more pessimistic on this one. But Ponsuda, I am very curious to hear your thoughts. What did you vote for? Oh, you want to know my actual vote? Yes. Oh, my vote was C, actually. C, okay, okay. Ponce yeah, going with man. the twenty-four hundo. Okay. Yeah, not too, not too much different from B. Only because like he got so many tracks. Like he definitely has had a lot of webs thrown out into the interwebs of you know to people out there. So there's definitely some people that know about this person. 
even if it's a small group. So I feel like there's probably some people listening to his stuff. Totally. But four four K and twenty one days is kind of crazy in today's current climate and SoundCloud world. That would you know, be really tough. Hard. That would be it's tough. harder to get streams these days. You know what I'm saying? So no doubt, got to get those big reposts. That's the name of the game, I guess. All yeah. right. Well, chat. You guys are saying A. I'll go ahead and lock in A for you guys. Let's find out. Three, two, one. It was A. Dang. This is a track from none other than Dip Slope. It's a track called okay. "Find Me at Your Door." So uh, yeah, well done, chat. You and I both take a point. I'm so sorry, Ponsuda. You were a little, a little <laughs> optimistic on this one, but <laughs> yeah. hey, I'm sure, I'm sure Dip Slope appreciates it. Hey, shout out to the work ethic. You know what I'm saying? Hundred percent. All right, chat one. All right, there we go. All right, get another random track pulled up here. Looks like we've got almost 700 tracks submitted on the Discord, by the way. So uh, yeah, if you guys want to help get that number up again, um, as a reminder, we reset our submission system about a month ago, I want to say, like three or four weeks ago, um, to make it a little bit more user-friendly and scalable. So uh, if you submitted something like super long ago, you, you might need to resubmit it. So go submit it on the Discord. We're going to pull up track number two here. Nice, nice, nice. Eight years ago. This one's an oldie. Ooh. Very familiar sample. I'm sure many of us have heard this sample before. It's a very different flip of this sample. I definitely have not heard this before. I've never heard this song before. Hmm. Skinny Winnie says, nice bounce, but that mixing is kind of eh. Yeah, I can see that. It is from eight years ago. I mean, let's see the exact date. April 9th of 2016. So yeah, that's some 2016 shit. But yeah, some cool patterns. I like their mix of like snaps and snares. You don't hear a lot of snaps, I feel like. At least not on funk beats. But this one's tough, man. It could have, it could have almost a quarter million streams. But either way, it's got at least 120K, which is kind of insane. And they only have five tracks? Only five tracks, that's right. That's, that's insane. Crazy, bro. That's pretty crazy. Yeah. I got a modest little answer though. Yeah? Yeah, I might I might lock in an answer here. I'm gonna judge it based on the fact that I don't I've never heard this song before. Fair enough. It has a lot of play it has a lot of plays though somehow. If there's still a lot of music out there. All right, I've got my guest locked in. Let me see if I can get this one to work. Nope, still not, still not posting it in YouTube chat for some reason. Whatever. All right, let me create another okay. poll in the YouTube chat. <laughs> is now live in YouTube chat. You got one minute. As soon as it says that it was posted one minute ago, it's getting closed up, okay? Don't miss your chance. Get your votes in. Hurry up and vote. That's right. Do your civic duty. <laughs> oh, let me get the, make sure the track loops. This track from eight years ago with the classic Great. funk sample, the halftime yeah. flip. Zeph has submitted this one. Okay. So far, Very chat is leaning B. 
B. Interesting. 43% of them are saying B. You guys think this one has 170K? Okay. Yeah, I mean, all of these guesses are pretty impressive. The track's been out for eight years, so certainly any of them are possible. What's good, Thousander? Welcome to the stream. All right, the poll has been open for one minute. I'm going to go ahead and close the poll here. Looks like chat overall, you guys went with B. 47% of you, almost half. It was almost a majority. So Jeez. almost a consensus. Um, and chat, we're very in sync today. I, I'm, I'm <laughs> so happy that even after all this time, we're still on the same wavelength. So I went with B. Ponsuda, I'm very curious. What did you go with? I actually went with B as well. All right. It's unanimous. Yeah, man. I went with B. Very I good. I feel like one, 123 was too low, you know, because the songs have been out for so long. I feel yeah. like it definitely had like a 170 on there. Yeah. But I don't think this song is by any like huge artist that we know of and listen to every day. I don't so. think it could be. They only have five tracks. They only exactly, have five man. tracks. And this one's from eight years ago. So they, they haven't really been staying consistent, even if they, even if they do one track a year. They yeah. haven't posted in like three years. So you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I've, that's why I went with one of the lower options. So we're all saying B. I'll go ahead and lock in B for everybody. Three, two, one. It was B. Well done, everybody. We all score a point there. This one's from Pat Daddy Perp. Man. So I, yeah. I, how did you find this track, Zephyz? I, I never heard of this guy. Just a random yeah. eight year ago track but he he worked that shit bro he was he felt that <laughs> no doubt he was cooking up a little 2016 cook up says he this one's from this coffin boys probably, volume one that boy probably made that shit in 30 minutes yeah just quick 30 minute fry up <laughs> <laughs> damn and how do you have a track blow up like that and not keep putting out tracks but he don't give a damn he got tired of the funk i guess He's not into it. <laughs> he probably don't even know that it has this many streams. Right, yeah. If anybody's friends with Pat Daddy Perp, tell him, Pat, Patrick, you got to get your ass back on SoundCloud. See what's going on. Your shit's popping. <laughs> All righty. Track number three. Let's get it pulled up. Do some guessing. Ten months ago on this one. Okay, okay. On Suda and Von Storm track when we need to get another one in. We had one on William on volume nine, I think. Yeah, man, we put that do it. Hey, bro. Okay. okay. This is real devilish trio or a devilish trio flip? It sounds like a flip to me. Yeah, you're right. Damn. Okay, ten months ago, and it could it could only have thirty four hundred streams. That's not that's not a ton for a track from ten months ago. They got seventy nine tracks though. That's true, man. They're grinding. Oh, they def it's definitely not a. So don't anybody vote a, please. They're <laughs> <laughs> putting in work. <laughs> Someone's calling this a Rolla Jones ad beat. I don't hear that. <laughs> I don't think you're Damn. listening to a lot of Rolling Jones. Yeah, but Rolling Jones got sauce, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's it's sauce too, but this is like, I don't know, different styles. Yeah, yeah. I feel like if Rolling Jones produced this, there wouldn't be so much high end. This would be like a yeah, right. much more gritty, a little more lo fi, for lack of a better word. Yeah, so I got my answer. Getting an answer locked in. Yeah, this one's tough. I feel like B, C, and D are all really close to each other. For real though. I mean, for all intents and purposes, they're the same. 65K to 79K across 10 months, that's pretty much the same thing. It really comes down to if we think that it's like an actual Baker feature. Because if it is, I could definitely see it pulling 80k in 10 months. But the, their vocals are the whole song. 
Yeah, I'm not super tapped into, uh, I'm not super tapped into Baker's music, so I couldn't say like, oh, I recognize these vocals, or oh no, these are definitely original type shit. That's true, I could be wrong. If it was my it's Twizzy, it. Freddy Dread, different story, <laughs> but uh, hey, Baker? Man, yeah, you. Yeah, well, I guess we'll find out. Okay, my answer is locked in. Chat, let me... I'm going to do another attempt at the Streamlabs poll. Yeah, it's still not working. All right, I guess Streamlabs has just decided to ruin my life. So let me get the YouTube poll set up real quick. Man. Listen to the ending. And Nevin, I apologize to you for having to edit this. You'll have to go back to the... You'll have to go back to the stream VOD on YouTube and screenshot the YouTube poll, I guess. All right. How many streams y'all think this has? The YouTube poll is now live. Let us know using those buttons. Are we thinking this one has A, 3,400 streams, B, 65K streams, C, 71K streams, or... Would you be as ambitious to say that it has D, 79.2K streams? Again, this track's only been out for 10 months. You know, it, I think that's enough time to pull, you know, tens of thousands of streams. But 80K, I mean, you're, that's going to need to be an original Baker feature or it's going to have to be from an account that's got a, you know, really big following, I feel like. Uh, that's too much, bro, in my opinion. That is a shit ton of streams. We, we will we will see what the chat thinks. Ah, okay. Okay, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. So far, we got 8% of people saying C. All right, the poll has been out for one minute. I'm going to go ahead and close it down here. Overall, chat, you guys are saying B. It was a, it was a vast majority of you. 60% were saying B, 65.5K streams. And, uh chat i feel like you guys are copying me at this point you gotta be like am i am i turning this too far towards the camera or something like <laughs> what's going on here <laughs> that shit wild Ponsu, bro, what did you what did you vote bro i voted b b all I right think. shit okay we're all on the same wavelength man i feel like we all are too good at this game we're too good we've mastered the formula <laughs> well For real hopefully we're not all about to be made to look very stupid right now i'm gonna lock in b <laughs> for us moment of truth here rising tide lifts all ships let's see three two one it was a dog D oh this is from oh this is a murasaki re-upload murasaki very uh, frequent submitter very active member of the community i appreciate you submitting this track so this one is a re-upload, I think? Yeah, it, it, it says here the original release is in 2019. Interesting. Okay, all in play, a dim delights. All right, yeah, with these Crazy, with these re-upload channels, I guess it's uh, it's a little tougher. It's a kind of a curveball question. We all look stupid. That's right, Skinny Winnie. Unfortunate. Damn. Very underrated. But, you know, that's the deal with these re-uploads. Unless it's a re-upload of a super popular track that got deleted or something... It's not really going to pull that many streams. So, unfortunate. Yeah, Nobody's scoring okay. any points on that one. I haven't heard of All In Play before. Have you? No, I haven't heard of this at all. Yeah, very but underrated. Yeah. Definitely, they definitely know how to produce. They know how to make beats. No kidding. Sound like sound like they have fun with it. That's for sure. Absolutely. Oh, it looks like they they had a little bit of a rebrand. Now they're KE Playa. K-E player. K player. All right. We'll get track number four pulled up here. There is no there is no punishment for the loser, okay? I do have something special planned for the loser, though, and it's a much more fun gimmick. It's not it's not a gimmick that completely invalidates the whole match, okay? It does require some luck, all right? So I think you guys will be happy with it, but you'll have to stick around to the end of the stream to find out what it is. All right. So basically, if you lose, you win. Not necessarily. <laughs> Not necessarily. That's how it. That's how it used to be. If you if you won the last round, you basically that's all that mattered. But we changed it up. Okay, you still need to score points. It matters. All right. All right. All, all right. right. We got a new track here from four years ago. Four years ago. Okay. 
<laughs> yes, Nevin, we are getting what you think you're getting. I don't know if I can guess who made this though. Not it's a hard guess. It's weird. I feel like some of the. That fucking perk is so funny. I can't help but crack a smile anytime I hear that perk in a song. I think that's the perk is honestly. Yeah. Some of these 808. Some of these 808s are a little off the grid, and I kind of like it. it. Gives it a little more of a. TikTok type remix, I hear that. This one's interesting, okay? Four years ago, and it could have as few as 25K or as many as 433K. That is a lot of streams. We got a good spread of answers here, too. 25K, 46K, 115, or 433. Got my answer locked in. YouTube poll again. Welcome to stream, Lala not listening. Yo. Alright. How many streams? A, B, C, D. Alright. The YouTube poll is now live in chat. You guys let me know by clicking one of those buttons in YouTube chat. How many streams does this song from four years ago have? This TikTok ad beat. Okay, we think it has A, 25K. Exactly. Or, thinking B, maybe something around 50K. It's respectable. Thinking C, just over 100K, just barely crossing that triple digit with a K threshold. Or, you know, four years ago, TikTok kind of goes crazy with these, with these, you know, goofy remixes. Could be pulling damn near half a million streams. Let me know what you think by voting. What's up, Hansuda? Yeah. Everybody vote. That's what right. I think. We want to hear from you. From TikTok, though, like, do they really go listen on SoundCloud? Or do they listen that's, on Spotify? That's the question, is it not? The TikTok to Spotify pipeline is well forged, but the same can't necessarily be said Maybe for SoundCloud. Not on Spotify. Right. Yeah. If it's not on Spotify, you're right. That could definitely be feeding some traffic to SoundCloud. All right. Chat, yep. you guys are saying A. 50% of you, half of you said A, which I think is very surprising. Pretty underrated. Really? Yeah, four, 14 votes in total, and seven of them said A. Very interesting. Well, wow. I went with D. I'm very, I'm very bullish on this one. I think that this Ooh, one is okay. going viral. I think that this one definitely, uh, definitely had the potential. At four years, yeah, that's plenty of time, I feel like to pull that many streams. 2019 was kind of a crazy year for these goofy beats. So that's what I went with. Yeah, I guess you're right. What you thinking? I, I guess I went with the chat, man. We, I also said, hey, fair enough. The on the same page, man. I All right. Why, but All right. Fair yeah, why, why'd you go with A? I don't know. I just, I, I guess I didn't think about I was really convinced about TikTok to Spotify, you know, but then mm -hmm. I didn't think until after I put my answer down that like maybe it's not on Spotify. Yeah, that's a great point. We will so. we will find out. So you guys are saying A, let me lock in A for you guys. Did it go viral? Possibly on TikTok. Let's find out. Three, two, one. It was A. This is from Lias. <laughs> oh my God, I'm such an idiot. Nevin is probably in chat shaking his head because i just listened to this song with him for the first time over the weekend oh my god i'm yeah. such an idiot and i literally made the same comment about that same perk when we listened to it i didn't realize it was the same song i'm such a such an idiot yeah. okay well look at that ponsuda you're making a little bit of a comeback but chat is kind of running away with it here you're we're tied but chat has officially taken the lead Three to Three. two to two. Yeah. Damn, Lias. Yeah, he's been in the game for a minute. 
And uh, yeah, he's got some pretty uh, pretty saucy beats, if I do say so myself. Yeah. Versace robe is this one. Hashtag sauce. Very accurate tag. Shout out to Elias. Um, uh, a very, very fun beat. This shit was hard. Absolutely. Um, Elias, by the way, um, is a very talented animator as well. He did the uh, animated uh, cover art oh. for... Holy Mob, God is my witness. And he's done a bunch of other really impressive ones, too. So everybody go fuck with Lias. Super talented, multi-talented producer. So go check him out. Hell yeah. Love to see it. All right. Well done, chat. Let's see if you guys can keep that energy. Let's get the next track pulled up. Some roads? Well, creamy road music about the liquid, also known as syrup, lean, or purple drink. Okay. I gotta say, man, if this ends up having 36 streams, I'm gonna be really disappointed in SoundCloud. Yeah, bro, that's crazy. In 23 days, there's no way. Mmm, a little sax action, okay. okay. It definitely wanted that splice action. Yeah. You've heard, have you heard one of these layers on splice? Nah, but like, it's just too perfect. No, I feel you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The layers are too layery. Yeah. I mean, the good, it sounds amazing. A good like, there. It made something unique from something that's you know so classic. Yeah, yeah, totally. I really, I think the bass line is like a standout for me on this track. I think the the bass line is pretty sick. Yeah, that bass line is fire. They know just when to cut that 808. They know just when to slide it. It's super nice. Yeah. So, this one's kind of tough. B and C are super close. I'm going to say, I, yeah. I really hope it's not A. But between B and C, that's kind of a toss-up. Or D, you know. I feel like 3,200 streams in 23 days, that's pretty doable for somebody who's got, like, a built-up audience. So. Yeah. I'm going to lock in a guess. Yeah, no way. I think I, I, I got, think I have a good idea of what this one has. I got my guess in. All right, let me set up the poll for YouTube chat. Oh shit, I don't want to show my guess. <laughs> All right. I believe the poll is now open in YouTube chat. You guys, let us know what you're thinking. We're thinking A, 36 streams, B, 1,300 streams, C, 1,500 streams, or D, 3,200 streams. As a reminder, track's been out for a little under a month, and it's from a, an account with 40 tracks on SoundCloud. Man, they working. All these, a lot of these guys are working. 100%. They're putting in that, putting in that work on their grind to to, to 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 bring in the streams yeah question is did it pay off how long has it taken them to get to this level how many people we got in chat um that's a great question actually we got 28 people watching right now 17 votes hey. 17 votes here it looks like the d might take it yep the poll's been out for a minute so i'm gonna close it chat is voting wait did the results get posted what happened uh -oh. the fuck happened did the poll results not post you guys voted for d if i'm remembering correctly let me refresh the page and see if maybe it just isn't showing up on my end no no okay it got posted you guys voted for d 41 percent of you okay Nobody voted for A. Not a single person, um, which I think is, <laughs> is, yeah, that's fair. That one, 
Now, That's crazy, bro. I've said stupid things like this in the past, but there's no way it's A. Okay, can we all agree? I think it sounds like we can all agree. Um, yeah. Chat, I, I, I'm in agreement. I think that this one could easily pull 3,200 in 23 days. So that's what I went with. I went with D. How about you, Ponsuda? Yeah, man, I went with D as well. All right. It's unanimous. Yeah. Well... Yeah, it sounds like track, so, yeah, and they got a lot of previous tracks, so I felt like it definitely had the the chance to have that many plays. No doubt. All right, well, let's find out for sure. Voting D, please don't be A. Three, two, one. Wow. Why, why do I keep doing this to myself? Are you fucking what? kidding me? Vistro main Vistro main is a member of the community. What are we doing here, folks? Go show some love to Vistro Main. What are we doing here? What are we doing yeah. here, y'all? That's insane. What the fuck? No shot. Oh, my Lord. And it's a collab with Besno. I believe Besno is also a member of the community. So appreciate you guys submitting this track. Horribly, horribly underrated. I got to say, you guys really have your shit figured out. Like I said, big fan of the bass line on this one. I'm not sure which of you did the bass line, but... Man, that shit was speaking to me. Oh, my God. Yeah, y'all, y'all absolutely killed that track. And y'all definitely deserve way more than 36 plays. And y'all shall get it very soon, I'm sure. No kidding. Yeah, you guys have been putting in work. Vistro Man, you got 40 tracks on SoundCloud already. I think that you keep putting out shit like this, shit's going to pop. No time. Eric D in chat. What up, dog? Eric Dog. He's got that Eric Dog in him. <laughs> All right. Let's get the next track pulled up here so we can get some points on the on the board. Cuz man, we all fl- we all flopped on that one. Yeah, man, I'm not doing too hot. Hey, I'm with you, dog. We're holding it down here in last place. <laughs> All right. 2 years ago. Let's hear it. Uh, Dang, that's, shit. that's some rock shit. Mm-hmm. This shit could have a quarter million streams. That's crazy. If it's your phone, then it's not surprising. We'll see. <laughs> I, feel I, like I, I wish the melody had a little more complexity to it, maybe. It's just the same, like, few notes over and over again, but... Or maybe it just needs, like, another layer or something. Some sort of counter melody. Yeah. But yeah, yeah it, it goes hard. Drums are sick. Pretty, uh, pretty overused, overused acapella, if you ask me, but... Everybody's got to start somewhere. 44 tracks from this person on SoundCloud, by the way. Flip is unique, to say the very least. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no kidding. I don't know if I've heard a track like this with those vocals. Yeah, so I think that kind of redeems him using these vocals. This is definitely crazy, though, bro. It's like some Y2K shit. Yeah. (laughs) No shit. How close is this to being three years old? I'm curious. Okay, it's pretty, it's coming up on three years in August. Okay, okay. Yeah, this one could definitely pop off. Okay. Yeah, these melodies are definitely from scratch. This sounds like a stock strings preset to me. They put that counter melody you were looking for. (laughs) Yeah, exactly. I appreciate I appreciate them listening to me. Real time real time feedback on that. <laughs> this one definitely has the potential to pop. Now the question is how much in two years? We got two answers here that are pretty close to a quarter million. Which is a lot. Especially on SoundCloud, I feel like. Not Pulling a real. quarter million in two years is kind of a that's a tall that's a tall order on SoundCloud. It's it's possible though. It certainly is. I'm going to lock in a guess here. I think I have uh, 
I've come to a conclusion on this one. I'll drop this shit. I'll drop this shit, man. <laughs> That's a pretty good impression. <laughs> I'll have to hit you up next time I want to do a copyright free version of that that tag. Yeah. All right, you got your answer locked in? Yeah, I got my answer locked in. All right, I'll start a poll for YouTube chat. How many streams? Everybody vote, everybody vote. A, B, C, D. All right, the poll is now open. Yes, there it is in YouTube chat. Everybody do Hold your duty. Vote it up. That's do right. Your, do your thing. We think this one is a little more underrated with 14k. Maybe, uh, maybe, maybe it's pulling like 90k. If so, you can vote for B if you're feeling that way. Or if you think this one's closing in on a quarter million streams in just two years, then you can go with C or D. They're pretty close. They're pretty close. We got 11 votes in here so far. So far, B is running away with this. So if you guys don't want the Bs to take it, you gotta get those votes in, okay? Yeah, man, vote it up. So far, chat seems pretty confident this one's pulling 85K in two years, which is still super, that's a super big amount of streams to pull in two years, I feel like. I feel like I'm normally impressed if I can pull 40K in a year. So <laughs> 80K in two years, that's like some pretty consistent momentum. You gotta think about the genre though and think about the details of the song like you could tell this person's been producing for a long time they do have 44 tracks so it's certainly possible chat you guys with 14 votes submitted 57 of you 57 percent of you said b so you guys are thinking it's closer to 90k which is still a lot of streams yeah, i'm not i'm not quite as confident on this one so i went with a i think that this one Ooh. Just the in the certain uh, the certain instruments that they used on this one the sounds I feel like on the melodies just sounded a little cheap to me, so that's that's the only reason I was a little more pessimistic on this one. That's a very amazing point. I actually went with D. Uh, I guess we're all on different pages this time. Makes it interesting. But yeah, I went with D because I just felt like with the I don't know with how many tracks they have and how long it's been out and the style like it's so unique i felt like this person probably has a pretty decent fan base if i had to guess fair point fair point let's find out so chat what did you guys say b you guys are thinking 85k so i'll lock that in for you guys let's find out just how underrated is this guitar rock funk track <laughs> from two years ago three two one it was a Ooh. Let's go. Hey, bro. I'm tied I'm up with side. chat. L chat. I'm definitely the, the lowest of the low now. Hey, it's all no good. Lower than me. Like I said, man, it, it, if you end up with the lowest score at the end of the game, all you need is a little bit of luck, and you could bring it back. But uh, for now, it's looking like me and chat are tied. Ponsuda in a close second, just one point behind. So this one is Fuck That Shit featuring uh, One Odom Defect. Am I... Okay. I, I, I Odom Defect? I don't know. By Mobsta187. Which, uh, yeah, I mean, 500 followers on SoundCloud. I guess I'm not super surprised to see that it's pulling 14K in two years, but still a respectable amount of streams. I mean, if you're pulling 260 likes and 14K streams, that's, that's respectable. That's respectable. Yeah, and it's valid. yeah, about uh, let's see, twenty percent of chat was saying A, so they were some of them were on the right track. I mean, <laughs> especially considering with how many followers they have, that's a lot of streams. You know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, yeah, totally, totally. And they got forty four to tracks, them. so uh, it's possible that they've you know they've gotten a little bit more buzz recently. So with their more recent tracks, so they thank got, you for like, that. Unique art with the uh, army too. Oh, a hundred percent. Aesthetic. It's pretty dope. I wonder if that's like original art. Very cool. No see. All right. Well, another eventful round. We got another point on the board here. Let's get another track pulled up. Track seven. That's right. Two months ago on this one. Okay. A little more recent. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, it's a tape. <clears throat> tape, you say. Get a little 22 minute EP action. Hey. Justin, the U.S. citizens are going crazy as we send off our biggest ballers. <laughs> Who recorded that shit? That was definitely this dude's girlfriend or something. The leader of the terrorist organization group left out a bold statement stating that he will only have a truce meeting with the U.S. if he can choose who he meets with. I don't know that anything if it's with dead hippie or ghost town. I want to destroy the U.S. Young Nicholas? Is that what it said? <laughs> I am Young Nicholas. Sending our ballers off right now with a gift. The loudest weed on the market from the U.S. for their courageous act. This is what he had to say. I got a 12-pack of that gorilla. That shit you can only find walking along the hashish transport paths in Azerbaijan. I'm smoking on Bhutanese <laughs> Shadow Garden grown Dark Evil pack. They watered this. <laughs> this is one of the craziest pack. intros to a shit tape so I've heard in a minute. Asking me where's Ronald? That's Mega. definitely shit some turn your pacemaker AI off. shit. Nuclear levels of sap. Oh yeah. Lung slaughtering. You, you don't think Joe Biden said this? Shit got diamonds. Hell no. So you know THC to see. <laughs> I didn't watch the State of the Union. Swag. You know he could have gone off on a little bit of a yeah, tangent. Nefarious <laughs> evil sorcerer moon grass. This shit straight out of K. You don't talk that clearly. This shit is what shot too. <laughs> that's that's a fair <laughs> point. For real dog. Peace. I'm fucking on my beach and focus on my rest. <laughs> Won't leave without my cash. Damn, you had a minute and a half intro. That's for this. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not a fan of this tape opener. Maybe the tracks afterwards are a little better. Let's skip around a little bit. Fox News and Vice after smoking crack. <laughs> <laughs> the intro was hard. Okay, the intro is kind of kind of went hard, but the tape opener was a little weak sauce. The beats are hard, bro. Who produced this? This beat is crazy. This would have been a better opener if you asked me. Yeah, bro, I, wish I could hear the beat by itself. First track. First track was mid. I really fuck with this one though. A little slowed switch here at the end of that one. Let's hear it. <laughs> okay. This at this at real ass ice. This at make you freeze. This at pearly white. This at break your teeth. This at white. This at break your teeth. Okay, dude, this tape is all over the place. I feel like it's got some, got some inconsistent, not 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 the best quality control, if you ask me. Think this is a rapper? The, the vocals are pretty consistent across the board, so it's it's possible. Yeah, I think it's a rapper's tape. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. I like the uh, like the dr the drill influence, the Chicago drill influence. Yeah, yeah, it's super hard, dope. Bro. I like his his beat selection is pretty dope. Two months ago, though, that's the question. It's pretty recent, low key. Mm hmm. All right, I'm locking in a guess here. Let me know when you got yours locked in and I'll open the poll for chat. Yeah, I got mine locked in. Bet. All right, chat. You can now vote in YouTube chat. There's a little poll with a few buttons that opened up. Let us know how many streams you think this tape from two months ago has. You thinking it's got A, 3,700, B, 7,100, C, 12.1K, or D, 23.1K. It had quite a crazy uh, intro. Quite a crazy intro, very memorable. Um, 
but I gotta say, pretty pretty weak tape opener in my in my opinion in terms of the first track. But the rest of them, they kind of hit. Yeah. Seemingly, uh, seemingly a rapper take. I I tip my hat to the producer of this tape or yeah, producers. Sure. Yeah, I'll be curious to see if it's like a. A rapper who also produces, a rapper and one producer, or a rapper and multiple producers. Yeah, me too. <laughs> it's like some little B shit. No, for sure. All right. We're gonna honey. Chat, you guys are saying A. You guys are a little more pessimistic on this one. I don't necessarily blame you. <laughs> you couldn't decide between 3,700 and 23,000. 30% of you said D. Okay, so... uh I decided to split the difference a little bit. I went with B. I think that this one, you know, the 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 mid, you know, tape opener, I think might help might have made it suffer a little bit, might have held it back a little bit. But overall, like I was saying, I think it's a pretty strong tape in terms of the production and yeah, I think very memorable intro. So that's why I went with B. Well, these songs are like you're the people who watch the stream submit these songs, right? Yep. Okay, so I felt like, you know, this was a, a rapper who did a tape who might have like a little modest following. So I went, go ahead and went with C. C, okay, 12K. Yeah, that's... Yeah, man, I went with 12K. Like, they got that in two months. That's valid. Okay. Yeah, two, 12K in two months is, is nothing to scoff at. And like you said, definitely possible that they've built up a little bit of an audience. I got 27 tracks here on SoundCloud. So anything is possible. Yeah. Chat, Very you guys fun. said A, so I'll lock in A for you. Let's find out just how underrated is this track from two, this tape from two months ago. Three, two, one. It was B, 7,100. And this is from Ghost Town. I've not heard of Ghost Town. Yeah, me either. Interesting. So it was in between our answers. <laughs> Produced by Ghost yeah, Town and Dead Hippie, it looks like. Oh, nice. Possibly. So or maybe it's like out. a collab tape. I, I don't know. I can't quite tell. But either way, pretty hard tape. Some pretty sick artwork, too. Yeah. That's so, fire. Yours truly taking the lead. You guys are going to need to catch up here. Damn, I'm that's... Probably even worse behind. What is this? The Worm and Jeremy Lin. <laughs> what? This is some crazy... Uh, this is some crazy shit. Okay, we got we got some notable figures in the comments here. I saw Mista down here somewhere. Yeah, Mista. Good shit. Okay, okay. Got the Mista cosign. Zach Rabbit's down here too. I've heard of Zach Rabbit. <laughs> Interesting. Well, well done to Ghost Town and Dead Hippie. Like I said, one of the most memorable <laughs> intros to a tape I've heard in a minute. So they got Absolutely. something going for them. I have them. to agree with you on that. You got the AI in there and everything. Yeah, that's right. All right. Yeah, I had not heard of Ghost Town before, but I guess I'll keep them on the radar. All right. Getting the next track pulled up. 20 days ago. 20 days. Ooh. This shit could have seven streams. <laughs> you about to find out based on how it sounds. A little four on the floor action. Pretty groovy, yeah, no kidding. <laughs> this is a five minute track. This better have some this better have like six switch ups, okay? I'm not about <laughs> to listen to some four on the floor pattern for five minutes straight. Not for real though. This drop needs to be crazy, dog. You can't keep us waiting for over a minute. This feels like, uh, <laughs> this feels like some, music. yeah, yeah, it's like, to me, it reminds me of, like, the music that would play in the background of, uh, 
like an instructional video showing you how to do something. You know what I mean? Like a wiki how video. Yeah. Here's how to Ooh. here's how to turn on your new pioneer DJ controller. Left. <laughs> right. Up. Down. <laughs> Is this an exercise video or are you doing like Dance Dance yeah. Revolution? Five, six, seven, and eight. <laughs> okay. What is that porno music, boy? Some porno music. <laughs> Got a little breakdown here. What's this here? This is the Grand Theft Auto Vice City music. Oh shit, we got some pitch automation. Uh oh. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, the same exact drop as before. Come on, dog. <laughs> this shit is five minutes long. Okay, so melody. I really like that melody. That's sick. Hell yeah. This should be the whole this should be the whole song. Just do this drop but for oh, like right. two minutes. That sounds like a classic sample, Loki. It does. Dude, if that's a custom if that's a custom melody, that one that shit hits. Yeah, it's pretty far. Okay. Pretty pretty standard little four on the floor house track we got here. Now the question is, how many streams can it pull in 20 days from an account with 10 followers? That is the question. I got my guess. I got my guess locked in. I've got my guess locked in as well. Let me set up the poll for YouTube chat. Alright, YouTube chat. You should have the ability to vote in the YouTube poll in chat now. Let us know what you think. This four on the floor, five minute house beat from 20 days ago. We're thinking it has A, seven streams, B, 200 streams, C, 2,800 streams, or D, 4,200 streams. So far, we got 10 votes in, and it is unanimous. You guys all think that this one has seven streams. <laughs> if you don't That's see the poll, up, yeah. try refreshing the stream, maybe? I don't know. It's shown up for That's some people. Up, y'all, bro. Damn, y'all are just dogpiling this track. Seven <laughs> streams? Fewer than the number of tracks they have. Okay, we got we got <laughs> one vote for B and one vote for D, it looks like. One person's going 4,200 streams on this one. Boy. That's lofty. All right. It's been out for a minute. I'm going to go ahead and close the poll here. Chat, you guys were uh, at the end there. You were a little split. Oh, no. It looks like the D vote switched to B or something like that. Yeah. Okay. So, no. Wait. No, no, no. Somebody, somebody switched away from C at the last minute. Okay. So, we got one vote <laughs> for B, one vote for D. And... Every other vote went for A. You guys are thinking this one's, I don't know if I'd say underrated or like around the right <laughs> level. I don't know if I would go like as high as 200. I feel like it deserves more than seven, but it's not getting 200. So I went with A as well. What do you think in Ponsuda? I felt like, you know, they had a lot of fun with it. They Definitely put a lot of work into this song, but uh, it was definitely showing a lot of inexperience. So I w went ahead and went with A as well. Yeah, totally. I, I agree with what you're saying. I feel like one of the hallmark signs of, you know, a beginner producer is just not knowing when to end the song or, or letting things go on for too long. And a five minute track for a four, I mean, the fucking intro was a minute <laughs> long, a minute long of just yeah, a four on the floor it. standard house beat. And I guess can't that be, I'm not be doing that. Yeah, I'm not super tapped into the house scene, but I feel like that's a little too long for an intro that basic. So we're all saying A. 
Let me lock in A here. Watch us be totally flabbergasted and have 4,000 <laughs> streams in 20 days. Three, two, one. Okay, it was A. It was A. All this right. one is called Limit from Sir Cartaw. So, uh, a deep. <laughs> Sir Cartaw. With the Deep <laughs> House beat. Okay. Deep House. Yeah, I've heard of Deep House. I don't know how it is different from just house house but i think deep house is like really smooth and a lot of deep bass lines you know what i'm saying mm, okay well I, I i will say these headphones aren't the best at getting like super deep bass lines to come through so it's possible he's got some crazy sub patterns in there but yeah i wasn't picking up on it i don't think so Ah, we got Stealth Lemon throwing Nevin under the bus saying that he's the one who voted for D. Wow. Damn. Wow. Makes me even oh. madder that it's French, is it? Oh, oh the name, <laughs> yeah, yeah. These Cut damn tall. Frenchies. Oh, my God. Wow. Okay, <laughs> I guess that's not super shocking. Interesting. So th this person has four followers. Likes. They're pulling more streams than they have followers, so that's... That's a good sign. You know, that's that's a pretty good indication, I guess. So keep at it, Sir Kata, and uh, maybe it'll pay off. <laughs> I think if I had one big piece of advice, it would be, you know, sometimes less is more. You know, you don't you don't need to let that four on the floor pattern just carry out for, you know, two minutes straight. I don't think this yeah, track think, needed you know, you to be five You have to understand minutes. people's attention span is kind of declining, so you have to, like, you know, supplement that and make the intros a little shorter nowadays, I feel like. 100%. 100%. Well, we all scored a point on that one. So for that, we thank you, Sir Kartal. Kartal. Let's get this one pulled up. This one's five years ago from someone with 50 tracks. Damn. We got a pretty big range here to work with, too, so we're gonna have to listen closely, okay? Need to go pop an Addy mid song, it's too long. <laughs> <laughs> That's, good. That's fucked up. Konnichiwa. Did you say Konnichiwa? Arigato, <laughs> <laughs> Shaimas. Senpai. Are we sure this one's from five years ago and not like nine years ago? This shit sounds Real like though. like authentic bass trap music from like 2014, yeah, 2015 bro. type beat. Real talk. I feel like I know who this artist is, but I can't remember their name. I feel like they all use that same 808. It's like got a very specific like warmth to it. I'm gonna say this mug got a lot of plays though, but how many? I really fuck right. with this one. I got my vote locked in. I gotta hear this second drop first. Okay, yeah, we got a little little filter action going on. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. We got a little slowed part. Reverb on the master equals heat. Reverb the song. Oh, damn. Do it my way. The water sounds. Oh yeah. I really like the snare patterns on this one too. How they come back with that little type shit. Hell yeah. Pretty dope. I'm pretty stumped on this one actually. I don't know which of these I'm gonna go with. I really fuck with the track though, I can say that much. This person has 50 tracks, so it's certainly possible they've kept at it, you know? It's certainly sure. possible. 
I'm excited to see who made it. Yeah, me too. I'm hoping it'll be somebody I recognize, because, I mean, I used to stream this type of shit all the time. Yeah, me too. Like, back, like you said, like, 2014, 15. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna lock in a guess here. All right, YouTube, let me get the poll set up for you guys. All right, the poll is now open. So you guys can let me know by pressing one of those buttons in chat. How many streams does this track from five years ago have? You're thinking on somewhere on the lower end? It is pretty recent for a track that sounds like this. Only five years ago. So, you know, I, I wouldn't be shocked necessarily to see it pull in only 20K. Or you could go, you know, 50, or sorry, 179K. That's B. You could go with C, about 400K, or D, damn near half a million streams. That is a shit ton of streams to pull in five years even. Yeah, that's, yeah. It's a hard good. one. It's a hard. It's a hard question. Mm -hmm. We got sixteen in chat. Welcome. So far, it looks like chat is leaning towards B, little middle middle of the road. They can't quite make up their mind. We do have a lot of votes for A, though. You guys are thinking this is a little more underrated. All right. See that. Poll's been open for a minute. I'm gonna close it chat almost half of you said b so you guys went with b overall and i agreed i don't i don't know if this one was posted quite long ago enough to be pulling those 400ks 500ks type shit so i went with b it's a super well produced track in my opinion i think it fits perfectly into that whole corner of the you know base trap re reverb trap scene reverb trap. uh yeah so i didn't i didn't want to go as low as 22k so that's why i went with b nice i went with c because i don't know i was really stumped on this one i couldn't really gauge whether it was between b or c but i went with c because i felt like like you said it was a good track and they did their thing they got a bunch of tracks in the past so Hundred percent. Hundred percent. All right. Well, let's see. What did you guys go with? B. So I'll lock in B for you guys. Let's find out. This track from five years ago, how underrated is it? Three, two, one. Wow. It was A. It was A from Resonance. I've I feel like I've heard of Resonance before. So that surprises me. Wow. Only twenty two K. So the A's, you guys were onto something. 33% of you guys are probably so upset right now to see you could have had a point if only you convinced some of those B voters. Unfortunate. So nobody scores a point here, I don't think. Yeah. None of us voted A. That is super disappointing. Yep. That is super disappointing, though. Have you heard of Resonance before, Ponsuda? I don't, I don't think I have. And honestly, when the... When you made the connection of like it's five years ago instead of being like nine years ago, it makes sense that it has 22. Okay, you know. Yeah, it's uh, it's a little weird. I I I mean, I guess it makes sense if you got 2,800 followers. You know, it's gonna be a yeah, little bro. tougher to pull. You know, hundreds of thousands of streams, even in I five mean, he, years. He was basically trying to recreate a style that was popular five years before he dropped this track. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm. I feel like it, the stats make sense. Totally. Yep, yep, I could definitely see that. Makes sense in retrospect. I'm just a little sad. I guess it's like sad to see that see scenes <laughs> dry up like that. I feel like the funk scene is kind of undergoing a similar thing. I, you know, it doesn't pull this quite pull the streams that it did five years ago. I think I think funk is just. I mean, it's just because SoundCloud isn't pulling the same streams that it used to. Yeah. But yeah. Totally. I feel like Spotify the... is going off the chain, bro. I don't know if this genre is even on Spotify, but that's something to look into. Yeah. Totally. I would be curious, actually. Like, what what are resonant? What is they, resonance? They might be on uh, crazy playlists. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right now? What is resonance's Spotify stats like? Somebody, <laughs> somebody gotta let me know. Well, uh, thank you for that submission. Whoever submitted that one, um, very fire track. I don't know if the person who submitted it 
is in the Discord anymore because I can't click on their name, but I don't know. All right. Look we'll at the next track pulled up. One month ago. Okay. Super unique flow to it. It's the stairs, I think, in the ride. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of a lot of fucking treble on this song. A lot of high end. I really like that that like one note flute sample that's just sitting back there in the back. Yeah, that one. Line is pretty sick too. I kind of hear some like uh, Beaster the God influence on the drum work. Do you fuck with Beaster? I've heard of him, but I don't know if I've listened to him enough to make the connection. Oh, you gotta check out some of his shit. It's crazy. He does a lot of a lot of his um, he does a lot of his drums off the grid, and it goes crazy. He's got such a good uh, sense for that yeah, type of shit. You can never go wrong doing that shit. Mm -hmm. Well, this is tough. This person only has 12 tracks on SoundCloud. I got my guest locked in. I do as well. I'm going to open the poll for chat now. Well, I got to create the poll. All right. YouTube chat, the poll is now open in chat. So press one of those buttons. Let me know how many streams you think this song from one month ago has. If you think it's super underrated, you could go with A, 76 streams, which is really not a lot of streams to pull in a month, especially if it's a track this well produced, in my opinion. Um, you could go with B, 364 streams, almost one stream for every day of the year, if you'd like. Or you can go with C, 1,400 streams. That's a little lofty, I think, for somebody with 12 tracks on SoundCloud. But you know what's even loftier than that? 11.7K streams. You can vote D if you want to, but I really feel like that is a shit ton of streams to pull in one month for, a, for an account with only 12 tracks. I have to agree. So far... Chat is leaning towards C, it looks like. Pretty short track too, only a minute and a half. That's, That's something I failed to something I failed to consider. These tracks that are a little shorter, they've got a lot more replay value. You know what I'm saying? Like if somebody plays true, it yeah. and likes it, they're gonna run it back, and that's another stream on the stream count. So Absolutely. We got 13 votes point. in from chat. Chat, you guys went with C. It was a pretty close race. The A's almost had it, but C <laughs> pulled it off right at the end there. So you guys are going with 1,400 streams, which in a month for a, for an account with 12 tracks, that is a little ambitious. But I, 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 I can understand where you're coming from. I personally went with B. I feel like it's way too good of a track to only pull 70 streams in a month. <laughs> but at the same time, with only 12 tracks on SoundCloud, I don't know if they've established enough of an audience to consistently pull, you know, over a thousand streams in a month. So what do you, what do you think, Ponsuda? I threw a curveball. I went with A. I was like, man, this shit got slept on. But when you start bringing in the replayability thing, that's a good point. So I could see 1,400 or even yeah. 300. Yeah, totally. All right, so we all got different answers. This will be interesting. Um, and somebody is asking, who's the guy on your camera, Ponsuda? Who's that little guy? But it's Lil Wayne, cuz. That's weird. He's so, he's so little. That's <laughs> life size. It's, it's literally Lil Wayne. Where the camera? Here, go to camera. 
Yeah, man. That's how, Wayne, bro. How's your how's your battery doing, by the way? Are, are we at risk of losing the video anytime soon? Oh yeah, probably. <laughs> uh, actually, we got thirteen percent. Shit. Okay. We'll okay. Probably, like what? Oh, we got like thirty five minutes left in stream. So yeah, you're you're not doing too bad. Word, yeah. All right. Yeah, should be all right. Chat saying C. I'm saying B. Ponsuda's saying A. Let's find out. Chat, you guys voted C, so I'll lock it in for you. How underrated is this Beast or the God type beat from one month ago? Three, two, one. It was A. Ponsuda picks up another point. Yeah. How did you know? 21 followers, dog? Holy shit. Show some man. love to Angels, okay? This yeah, is man. a song Slept called on. Pluto. Very fire That's track. I had a feeling it just slept on, you know? Because it, I mean, it came out a month ago. They only have 12 tracks. Yeah, you were on the right track. You were on the right track. You can see this guy's super worried about copyright, too. He says, disclaimer, no profit <laughs> or money was made from this song. If there are copyright issues, then message me and I'll take it down. I don't... <laughs> what he were the definitely is, he's definitely making profit, I think. <laughs> Well, I don't know. On seventy nine streams, I well, he's not he's not making profit, but he probably has revenue. He has like the revenue action. Who were the Who are the vocals sampled from? Ready for oh, yeah. war? Who is that? Because I, I feel like uh, whatever. Play it, play it again. Baby Pluto flip. Yeah, I don't know. Um, uh, that's um Uzi. Someone's saying Uzi. They're, they're saying Uzi in chat. So, yeah, I feel like Uzi's label is not gonna, not gonna not message right. you if they have an issue with the fact that you used a copyrighted Uzi song. <laughs> so, yeah, they probably never hear it. I don't think they will, dog. Uh, but I mean, hopefully, hopefully it blows up someday, and they do, and they buy the rights to the official. Baby Pluto remix, okay? <laughs> How about that? So, uh, yeah, everybody go show some love to Angels. Very fire track. Let's move on to the next one. Ponsuda ties it up with Chat. Chat, he's hot. Hey, he's hot on, hot on my tail. <laughs> All right. Just next track here. One year ago. I thought you were different. So I can't I made a genre switch up. Distant. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna get copyright claimed on this shit. You're twisted, so sickening, baby. I'm tripping now. Lost my mind. Oh, yeah, this is some, some like hyper pop adjacent shit. Yeah. I know a lot of people in that corner of SoundCloud get a little touchy when you label something hyper pop, so I don't wanna really do this. Straight up label it hyper pop. Yeah. They're like, no, it's Webcore! It's Webcore! <laughs> hey man, it's all love. That's right. Genres mean nothing. Ponsuda, someone in chat is saying you did some major mewing. Did you do any mewing to get the get the jawline that you have today? Oh no, bro. I don't I don't really know what mewing is, to be honest. <laughs> He doesn't even know. That's he's just <laughs> born with it. Yeah, I was born this way. Hyperfunk minus the funk. Oh, I don't know, but they have 87 tracks, but that's a lot. That's a lot of tracks. I'm getting the feeling that this person has a pretty established fan base. I am going to. Oh, damn! One year ago, and the maximum it can have is 24k. Mm. That's interesting. All right, I'm gonna lock in a guess here. Let me know when you got yours locked in, and we'll get the YouTube poll running. I got my guess locked in. All right, chat, hold tight. I set up the poll. All right, YouTube chat. The poll is now live in chat. If you want to guess how many streams this hyper poppy kind of track from one year ago has this person has uh this person has 87 tracks on soundcloud so plenty of time to build up a sizable audience definitely sizable enough to pull 24k in a year but the question is do you think it's a little more on the underrated side if so you can go with a 2500 streams 
I think it's got a little more than that. You could go with 10K. That's B. Or if you're thinking that it's definitely pulling close to 20K, but not quite getting there, you could go with C, 17.6K. Or if you're thinking that this hyper pop shit goes crazy, <laughs> you go with 24K. That's D. We got 14 votes so far. Everybody do hold your up, civic duty. Do the thing. All right. 15 votes. Someone unvoted for a second. One of the votes went away. All right. It's been one minute. Let me close the poll here. All right. Chat, 60% of you went with B, 10.3K. A little bit of a middle of the road guess. Middle, middle of the road guess. You guys are kind of on the fence about this one. I, on the other hand, was shocked to see that the maximum option was 24K because... Um, Oh, I'm struggling to remember the name of the artist, but there's a particular like hyper pop adjacent artist that I'm thinking of who I thought was like super popping. So I was surprised to see it maxed out at 24K. I went with 24K. I went with D. I feel like this type of song really, really pops on SoundCloud, um, depending on if they're in that like hyper pop adjacent scene. So that's why I went with that. What did you go with, Ponsuda? I went with uh, 17.6K. All right. See. Yeah, I mean, because I don't know. I, I mean, it's a hard choice because a lot of the numbers are the same B, C, and D. But I I just went with C because, I don't know, it was very well mixed. They got a whole bunch of tracks. I feel like they could have got 17K easily. Yeah, totally. Yep, we got answers all across the board. So another interesting round on our hands, as long as it doesn't end up being A. If that's the case, nobody scores any points. So let's <laughs> find great. out. Chat, you guys went with B overwhelmingly. The ba the A's weren't even close. Okay, 26% <laughs> of you guys really not feeling this track. We'll see if you were right. Three, two, one. It was 10.3K. Well Dang. done, chat. You guys take another point. Tie it up with me in the lead. Whew. This is a close one, dog. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay, this was not the artist I was thinking of, and I still can't remember his name. Um, but yeah, this is Clover Scars and Cinder Twisted, produced by Cinder and Lumberjack. So I have not, yeah, I have not heard of these folks. Um, but yeah, for you know, twenty five hundred followers on SoundCloud, getting the verified badge with twenty five hundred followers—that's impressive, dog. <laughs> well done. You must have quite a few hits on your hands. Um, yeah, and, man, shout out. Yeah, and with 87 tracks on SoundCloud, it's it's not surprising that you got a few heaters on our hands. So, yeah, well done. Yeah. And uh, I'm surprised to see that it doesn't have more. But, yeah, nonetheless, well done, chat. You guys take the point on that one. Bit of a genre switch up. We don't get a lot of these types of these types of tracks on here. Yeah, you like totally switched the genre with that one. Yeah, I saw earlier when we had that house track, somebody was saying uh, that it was like the like uh, weirdest house funk they'd ever heard or something. It's like, I don't think it's <laughs> house funk at all. Actually. Yeah, I don't think there's any funk influence. In there. <laughs> no, not really. All right, this one's from three months ago. Pretty cool intro. Oh, yeah. yeah. Turn those sleigh bells down. <laughs> Sixteen saying this is perfect for Ponsuda. <laughs> Got a pretty wavy vibe. What you mean? You want me to rap on it? <laughs> yeah, just freestyle. Let's go in on this shit. Oh, bitch. Yeah, we from Dallas and we making all these. I 
Bro, I can't rap, bro. That's why I produce. <laughs> hey, you just just style it as some spoken word, like some spoken word rap. Bro, I actually want, uh, wrote a poem not too long ago. That was actually pretty fire. You're quite the lover boy. I'm not surprised. <laughs> it was a dark poem, but it wasn't about love. Though. Oh shit! Okay. This man's got some dark thoughts to put on paper <laughs> to get it out. It's a cool track. Yeah, it's not. Cool. I'll say, if there's anything I'm like not psyched about, it's the baseline. Um, yeah, the baseline is very underwhelming. But I think they made but some good use of made different like drum loops and shit. But they definitely had some good mixing in there, and you know, it made something that sounded unique. Yeah. With the exception of like the uh, um, the sleigh bells, man, the sleigh bells are way too fucking loud. But everything else sounds, for the most part, mixed pretty well. Yeah, I can't. I also can't hear it the same quality as you because I'm watching through your Oh, yeah, that's true. This person has 33 tracks. That's, an, that's a decent size uh, body of work, I'd say. Don't define it. That doesn't matter sometimes. That's true. Hey, Patrick Starr in chat says that he loves your music, Kansu. Hey, I appreciate you. Thank you. Much love. Man, Von Storm also got some crazy music. Y'all need to check that out, too. Who's Von Storm, bro? <laughs> Someone said I need to do a video with all the mob members. Hey, that'd be dope. Yeah. If we had, like, all of mob competing on the on the game show, that'd be kind of crazy. Yeah. Help us all at the same time, that'd be too crazy. <laughs> that'd be too... It'd get a little rowdy in here, I feel like. <laughs> I will say, um, they made good use of a bunch of different, like, layers and drum loops and shit. I think it could have used maybe some, like, more of a switch up in terms of the drums for a four minute track. Yeah. But overall, I think they did a good job of using, um, you know, you know, adding a lot of depth to it, I guess is the right way to say it. Yeah, I think with all the different layers, they definitely made something unique. Yeah. And I always, I always look for uniqueness because there's a lot of the same stuff going on around here. Totally. All right, I've got my guests locked in. Let me know when you got yours. I got mine. All right, let me set up a poll for YouTube chat. All right, YouTube. The poll is now live. If you check chat, you're gonna have four little buttons you can press. One says A, one says B, one says C, and one says D. So, depending on how underrated you think this track is, you could go with A, 11 streams. That's really not a lot of streams to pull over the course of three months, especially for somebody who's got 33 tracks on SoundCloud. But you know, our intuition has led us astray before. So, could totally be the right answer. Or you could go with B, about 400 streams. I think that for a beginner producer over the course of three months, I think that's pretty reasonable to expect. But at the same time, could also be 2,700 streams. That's C. So you could vote C if you think, you know, 33 tracks, that's enough to build up a decent sized audience. Bring that in over the course of three months. Yeah, that's totally doable. Or you could go with D. If you're really feeling confident about this track, you could go 3,500 streams in three months. I think that's pretty doable as well if you've got that audience built up. You got 14 votes in chat here. Most people are going with B. The poll's been open for a minute, so I'm going to close it. And yeah, chat, almost two thirds of you, 64%, a commanding majority, went with B. You guys are thinking this one's pulling about 400 streams. And uh, I'm with you. I'm with you. I feel like this track is. Hey, okay. I feel like this track is mixed pretty well. Too too well to only pull 11 streams in three months. I think if this person had like three tracks on SoundCloud or something like that, I might go with A. But the fact that they've been putting out tracks relatively consistently, it seems like, I feel like this track from three months ago is probably going to pull around 400. 
but I don't know if it's like unique enough or like mind blowing enough to be pulling thousands of streams over the course of three months for somebody who seemingly has not been in the game for a super long time. Yeah, man, I think you hit all the right points. I actually went with A. Fair enough. What what made you go yeah, with A? I went with A because it came out three months ago, and like I don't know, SoundCloud is just really slept on a lot of times, especially for artists who are not established. So I felt like maybe this one got slept on. This is true. This is true. And don't forget the fact that a lot of people are submitting their own tracks to the game show, and exactly. maybe they're submitting them to get put on. You know what I'm saying? So. Maybe they're like, this is my most underrated track. It's only been pulling 11 streams in the last few months. Let's get some Let's get some more traction here, okay? So, let's see. Chat, you guys went with B, so I'll lock in B for you guys. Let's see. Just how underrated is this track from three months ago? Three, two, one. It was A, let's Ponsuda. Go. Ponsuda takes the point on that one, and it's all tied up again. Look at that. First time okay. in the game, I think. We're all tied up. Dang. Super fucking close game. We are on it today. Holy shit. And why why Nick? Yeah, I think he's in chat. He submitted this track, it looks like. That is horribly underrated. I'm just going to say it right now. I, uh, I think this is, for the most part, mixed pretty well. And like I said, made, a, made good use of a lot of different layers and drum loops. So I'm surprised yeah. to see it only pulling that many streams in three months. So everybody go show some love to why Nick. Some hard art too. Uh, yeah, exactly. And he was uh, pretty silent during during uh, in the chat during that round. So I, I admire the restraint. Um, yeah, SoundCloud is not doing you any favors, it seems. So hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we can help you out a little bit. No, yeah, it's not your fault. It's SoundCloud's fault. That's right. I've been saying this. Discoverability, not SoundCloud's strong suit. All right, <laughs> we probably got time for. One more track. Here. Actually, I mean, we should probably go ahead and do one more track and then do a tiebreaker if we still have a tie that we need to break, okay? All right, bet. All right. Um, all right, 10 months ago. Got a lot, a lot of plays here. Yes. Fairly wide range here for a track from 10 months ago. And C and D are basically the same. device in a, much, a musty dungeon. This is like the type of shit that would soundtrack that experience. I, mean, I feel like if you're gonna subgenre things like that, you could do that with anything. Any song. True. Like, any song could be its own subgenre. 100%. I actually also have my answer locked in already. I'm feeling fairly confident I know where this one's gonna shake out, but we'll see. All right, y'all, the poll is open. So YouTube, feel free to vote in the chat. You have a poll there, A, B, C, or D. Let us know how many streams you think it has. A, 4,300, B, 11.7K, C, 21.8K, or D, 24.1K. If you're thinking it's on the higher end, I'm sorry that you have to decide between C and D. They're very close, within like 3,000 of each other. So yeah, that's a pretty great. tough one to pick between. Space funk, but the spaceship blew up. <laughs> I feel like it's definitely between A and B. That's a fair. That's a fair assumption. So far, chat's going with A. Chat's thinking this one's a little more on the underrated side. 
We got 12 votes so far. Get your votes in if you have not already. Andreas is saying he's going all in on C. He's pretty confident this one's pulling 20K in 10 months. It's possible. Okay. It is possible. All right. If you like a re upload or something. That's true. The poll is now closed. Let's see if YouTube will post the results. There we go. All right, that one was pretty close, y'all. Um, so, yeah, the Bs almost had it. C was making a pretty good run for the for the for the top spot, but A ultimately took it. You guys are going with A, four thousand three hundred and fifty streams. Now, something that I definitely took note of when I was listening to it is one, how simple the song is. It really doesn't change at all over the course of you know the three minutes that uh, of runtime and the fact that um yeah. you know they only got 12 tracks on soundcloud so that's that's not a huge discography not a lot of opportunities to really pop off and grow your fan base to the point where you could pull tens of thousands of streams over the course of 10 months so i agree with you chat i went with a i think it's going to be on the underrated side what do you think Ponsuda? I agree with y'all, man. I also chose A because of the amount of tracks they have. It really throws me off, makes me feel like, you know, they haven't had enough music posted out there. Unless it's like a re-upload, you know, like a second page of a popping artist or something. Yeah, totally. It's the only other way. All right. Well, it sounds like we're either all going to score a point or none of us are going to score a point. So I'm going to go ahead and lock in A here. Let's find out. Three, two, one. It was A. Well done, everybody. Everybody pat yourselves nice. on the back. I think that one was a pretty easy one. So, okay, we've had a track from Now Masa before. Uh, Lost to Time by Now Masa. Um, I think that we had a track from Now Masa on the back when episode. So, good to okay. see his name again. I think somebody told me that this is a new account from him, which is why he pulls pretty good numbers. I mean, 4,300 streams on an account with 114 followers. That's pretty good. Uh, um, that so, is yeah. pretty good, yeah. Sounds like this is a newer account for this guy, which would explain that. All right. Um, we're going to do some speed rounds here until we have the tie broken, okay? Um, and we got the funk okay. number here. We're all tied up at six. So let's break this tie, why don't we? <laughs> Five years ago, 979 tracks on SoundCloud. Damn. I feel like I've heard this song what the before. Fuck? This shit is crazy, dog. This is this Rolling Jones? I feel like this is like B and C are basically the same number, dog. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, I gotta just lock one in here. Okay, my guess is locked in. Let me know when you got yours. Alright, YouTube, the poll is open. You're only gonna have 30 seconds on this one, okay? Because we're doing a bit of a speed round, alright? Actually, I'm not gonna be able to see when it hits 30 seconds, only when it hits a minute. So, you guys get a minute still. Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi. <laughs> Everybody, get your votes in, okay? I see five votes so far. We think in A, 16K streams, B, 244K streams, C, 245K streams, or D, 423K streams. Get your votes in now. We got eight votes in so far. So far, chat is going towards B. So if you don't want B to take it, get that vote in right now. You can do it in the YouTube chat. A's are making a bit of a comeback. There's only 10 votes, so any vote can sway the sway the outcome. All right, we're getting a few more C votes, actually. Interesting. Interesting. It's balancing out a little bit. All right, it looks like chat's probably going to go with B, unless we get a huge influx of votes here at the end. All right, it's been a minute. Closing the poll. Looks like chat, you're going with B. Half of you went with B. I, on the other hand, went with A. 979 tracks on SoundCloud? Are you kidding me, dog? This is definitely a re-upload channel. There's no way this shit's pulling a quarter million streams, if you ask me. What about you? What are you saying? I went with the same answer, man. I felt the same exact way. I was like, I'm fairly certain this is a Rolling Jones track, and it has to be a re-upload, bro. Totally. There's no totally. way this, no way. I don't even think the OG has that many plays. Probably not. 
Probably not. Okay, so chat went with B. I'll lock in B for you guys. Three, two, one. It was A. Yep. Well I done, Ponsuda. We take the point on that one. The A's almost took it in the in the chat poll. So uh, so sorry, chat. You guys, uh, if you if you're upset about the uh... eliminated. Oh yeah, let's see. It's a it's a a channel called Sound Transitions. Okay. I've heard of them before. Interesting. And uh, it appears that this is a track off of Iced Out. Okay, so were they like distributing that album or that tape? That's interesting. Yeah, All right. Sure. Well, maybe. All right, Ponsuda. Now we got to break our tie, okay? All right, Sound man. good? We'll break our Sounds tie good. and then um, chat. You guys will get to do a little gimmick, okay? To see who wins overall, all right? <laughs> or to see, you'll see, you'll see. Just hang in there, chat, okay? You'll you'll <laughs> you'll appreciate this new new take on the end of game gimmick, okay? This one's for Ponsu. I'm a part of you, I, chat. I have no I have no idea either what's going to happen. <laughs> Let's break our tie here. All right, five years ago. Five years ago. Okay, okay. Chat, you guys won't be voting on this one, but you will be participating in a very fun end of game little activity that could change the outcome of the game. So, hang in there. Yo, this is quite the waveform. This shit is loud, dog. <laughs> this is how I like it. Yeah. I got, I got my guess. All right. Mine is locked in as well. All right. Oh, a little bit too loud, bro. Do you have your notebook with you, by the way? I want to make sure people don't yeah, think yeah. that you're just copying my answer. Uh, I would have my notebook. Yeah, I would show you it to the what? camera. Show it, show it to chat. Oh yeah, yeah. I have my notebook right here, y'all. I'd be writing my answers. Oh, it's pretty, it's pretty small, but I, I can read it from here. What did you? Is it that one? Did you go with A? Oh, did you go with oh, B? On. You want me to show my answer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's because I have this big ass notebook. Hey, you went with A, 28.5K. Yeah, okay. I went with B. A. Okay, so you're saying A. I'll lock in A for you. Ponsuda, were you correct? Three, two, one. It was B. Damn. <laughs> Your boy. That's the play it. In the, in the okay. speed round. Okay, so this one's from Mr. Playa. Yeah, okay. I've, I've heard of that guy before. Turning Earth Shot featuring skis. Now, all right. Ponsuda, I'm so sorry. You're going to take second place at the highest, I would say, okay? Unfortunately, there is no... Actually, I mean, I guess I could have you participate in the gimmick too, okay? That's fair enough. Okay. We'll have you and chat participate, okay? But first... Okay, first we'll have you participate, okay? We got the wheel of gimmicks here, chat. If you look in the upper right-hand corner of the, uh, of the screen right now, you'll see the wheel of gimmicks spinning on screen right now. This is going to determine how many points um, Ponsuda's score is gonna increase by, and then you guys are gonna get to spin the wheel, I'll spin it for you, to decide how many points you guys get added to your score, okay? You can see it still requires a bit of luck. There's a 50% chance that your score doesn't get adjusted at all. So it's a coin toss as to whether you, yeah, whether you get anything out of the gimmick, okay? But you have a 25% chance that you get one point. So, you, so theoretically, if Ponsuda gets a zero and you guys get a plus one, 25% chance, you could tie it up with him and tie in second place, okay? Or, you know, you've got like a 15% chance at plus two, like a 6% chance at plus four, and a 4% chance at plus 10, okay? So that's like a win it no matter what, basically, type of scenario, okay? Um, all right, Ponsuda, are you ready for me to spin the wheel for you? I'm ready. Spin that mug. All right. Drum roll, please. How many points are being added to your score? <laughs> I'm so sorry, Ponsuda. You got a plus zero. So it looks like you're sitting pretty at Ayo. seven points no matter what. Now you just have to hope that chat does not get a plus two or more. They must get the same. If that's the case, you will end up in last place for this game. So, chat. Without further ado, it's time for you guys 
Well, I'll spin it for you. But it's time for you guys to spin the wheel of gimmicks and find out, will you beat Ponsuda? Will you tie Ponsuda? Will you tie me? Or will you take the game? Anything's possible with a little bit of luck. <laughs> Three, two, one. Let it rip. Ooh. Plus one, you tie it up with Ponsuda. Well, Damn. you didn't want to go out like a hoe. I can respect that. Well done, <laughs> chat. You tie it up with Ponsuda. You guys are on Ponsuda's level. You guys are like certified it's legends, cool. basically, okay? Yeah, man, we all connected. One love to everybody. There you go. Wow. What a what a fantastic what a fantastic end to a fantastic game. Thank you so much for joining us, Ponsuda. I think it was a pretty fun, pretty fun game, and it's it's fun to it's fun to get your input on some of these tracks. Yeah, man, for sure. Thank you, guys. It's a blessing to be here. Totally. Thank you everyone who supports uh, my music and everything that we got going on together. Yeah. You know where where can people find you, Ponsuda? What what do you want to put on for? Man, I want to put on for Infinite Wave. I want to put on for Holy Mob. I want to put on for myself. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my girl. She's my everything. And yeah, I mean, we just really just trying to make a community in Dallas. So if you live in the DFW area, pull up to our shows and just see what we about. We just trying to play underground music and, you know, have a good time. And I'm just making music from my heart. So if you fuck with it, it ain't going to stop. <laughs> you, you are one like of the, you are one of the oh, most well. genuine people in the scene, Ponsuda. Thank you so much. It's been an honor getting to sit down with you and uh, play our little, our stupid little game with you. <laughs> well, yeah, uh, thank you. Yeah, GG's all around. Thank you guys for joining. Thank you, chat. As a reminder, we uh, stream live Wednesdays from 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern. So I'll see you here for possibly the SoundCloud Game Show live again here next week, yeah. next Wednesday, yeah. 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern. Without further ado, I will see you guys later. Peace. Peace.